I have the thank you. Thank you. And um, this is to uh, various modified pelvic triple osteotomy procedures available. However, minimally invasive approach needs to be developed in future. This study is to introduce a novel minimally invasive surgical approach that minimizes the times of interoperative flow scopies and size of the surgical incision, as well as its review of results. This year, osteotomy, we call it one finger technique. After added, added, uh, identifying the in interval between the adductor brevis and the pectineus in the index finger is inserted in through the interval between the adductor brevis and the pectineus. The fingertip is direct, directed towards the acetabular and the obturator externus muscles. As the finger pushes obturator externus, the issue limbs can be perceived beneath the muscles that covers the surface of the issue Remus. After reaching surface of the ischial remus, the obturator externus muscles and the obturator membrane are bluntly separated from ischial remus using Kelly forceps. And through this window, we can cut the ischial remus. remus. Pubic osteotomy could be finished in the same approach. Relief osteotomy by windows and gluteus attachment intact, tech, intact technique incise the external oblique muscles at the external oblique muscles insertion to expose the insertion of the iliac muscles. Use uh, periosteotomy, a uh, periosteum elevator to push the periosteum of the iliac away and at the same time push the external oblique and the iliac source to the inside of pelvic, exposing the inner plate of the iliac. This will be the inner side of the iliac bone osteotomy windows. Detach the origin of the tensor facial that are about 1.5 centimeter proximal similarly while retaining the origin of gluteus medius and minimus, exposed lateral aspect of iliac by, iliac by uh, elevating the periosteotomy and uh, extension of the joint capsule. The iliac vein epiphysis sparing technique when the osteotomy passes the end Interior edge of the acetabular joint capsule. Change direction of osteotomy to a more distal direction and cut the iliac bone in an L shape through the anterior inferior iliac spine. Acetabular repositioning. Following completion of the osteotomies, a uh, chain screw is inserted into control positioning of the Acetabular use T handle to clamp the uh, osteotomy fragment and then turn it into anti version and valgus and internal rotation. Post operative management and evaluation hip joint abduction brace is used for three weeks post operatively to maintain the hip joint extension and abduction at 30 degree after removing the brace, joint range of motion exercise and abductor strengthening exercises are encouraged. Six weeks post-operative partially with bearing is allowed and after 12 weeks full with bearing, radiological evaluation are performed, review acetabular index CE and MP by using AP review of the pelvis.
Oh, sorry. Uh, we find acetabular index and C angle improved very well. Also, migration percent percent improved very good. This is some cases we performed this seven years boy with LCPD on right side. We use minimal uh, invasive triple osteotomy or the acetabular side, and the style books. Three scores achieved during 23 months follow up. It, eight years ago with bilateral DDH, she has been reduction in the osteotomy history before she came to my hospital. So we use minimal invasive triple osteotomy, bilateral, and, uh, and the deformity of proximal femoral were corrected concomitantly. Serine type two was achieved on both sides during 25 months' follow-up. So we can get conclusion based on our findings. Uh, G3 time minimally invasive TPO could achieve favorable results for hip dysplasia with open triadate cartilage complex and in LCPD patients who requires surgical improvement of the femoral head coverage. This technique could make pelvic triple osteotomy procedure simpler, safer, and more effect effective. Thank you.